When creating a new team, you can choose between three different privacy settings. Private, where people need permission to join. Public, where anyone in your organization can join. And org-wide, where everyone in the organization will be automatically added. This option is only available for global admins. Private teams are permission-based, which means that users can join only after the team owner lets them in. To join a private team, team owners can add users as members. Members of a private team can also request other users to join. Private teams are used when there will be sensitive data that is not allowed to be seen by everyone. When working on a project with specific people, and when collaborating with different departments across the organization. Public teams can be seen by everyone in your organization and anyone can join without the approval from the team owner. Public teams are used when there won't be sensitive data that could cause a data breach, for educational purposes and sharing knowledge, and when there is a common interest in a specific topic. You need to be careful as everyone can see everything inside public teams. It can also lead to decreased productivity if a lot of people join a public team. Org-wide teams are a particular type of public team where all users from the organization are added automatically as members, and global admins and team service administrators are added as owners. Org-wide channels can be used for company communications and Microsoft recommends allow only team owners to post messages, turn off team mentions, and automatically show important channels. If you realize you have chosen the wrong privacy settings, you can very quickly change it from private to public or from public to private. Of course, global admins also have the org-wide option. For more Microsoft 365 tips and tricks, subscribe to our channel and check out our Syskit blog.